All right, guys, we back at it again, and um, yeah, so this is gonna be something a little bit different here. This is a special request that um, I got from someone, so I decided to make this um, vehicle here, and it is actually the Ottawa Police Department. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right, but um. Hey, y'all take a look at it. I think I did a fantastic job on it. And like I say, I don't normally do this, but I decided that I would go with extra this time and make this vehicle for this person. So, um, hope you enjoy it. So, I'm just going to give y'all a quick rundown of the vehicle real quick. <laughs> He didn't want too many lights on it. He wanted it to be, you know, as simple as how they really have it. So this is what we got. Now, this is what the inside looks like. Uh, we have radars, we have a GPS up there, and we have our laptop here. So in the back, we have our guns right there. We have some window window bars and we also have a radar in the back back there with the two lights so this is light in stage three here so um, with the traffic advisor going uh, you do have the ability to turn the traffic advisor off and you have regular code three So I think that looks really, really good. Um, also, y'all know me. I, I have to go the extra mile. So I made it to where you can turn the spotlight on. As well as rotate the spotlight. So you can move the spotlight to whatever direction you want it to go in. And also the light shines with it. So that is one great thing that I like right there. And um, we also have uh, takedown lights. So with the spotlight, you got your takedowns as well. And y'all know this Valor light bar is super bright. So we got our takedowns with the spotlight on. And man, that looks good. So also, let's just say you want to turn your lights on as well, code 3, we can do that, still having the takedowns on with the spotlight. We have the ability to turn the takedowns back off and of course we're looking like that in the back with the takedowns. Uh, let's see. So we're going to turn those takedowns off. We're going to turn off all the lights there. And let's see if we can turn on our cruise lights. So these are the cruise lights, guys. And I think that looks amazing. So, um, yeah. So pretty much every light um, still kind of lit up. I think that looks good. So imagine on a traffic stop, and let's just say we can do takedowns, and we still have our crews in the back. I think that looks good. And if you want to leave the cruise lights on, and go into stage three, you have the ability to do that as well. And guys, this is Ottawa Police Department. I think that looks good. All 
Alright guys, so uh, drop a comment and uh, let me know what you think and uh, like I say um, I may be um, releasing this vehicle here so um, I guess just put a comment if you want the vehicle and I'll get with you So let's just say, hold on, I'm just gonna play around with the lights for a minute. So let's just put our crew, I mean, our uh, takedowns on. Yeah, that's nice. That is nice. I like how I got that glow effect. I don't know if y'all can actually like see that on y'all screen, but it's like it's just glowing on my end here. Super nice. So like we can turn off the spotlight and also guys to um, if you ever do want to get this vehicle to turn on the spotlight you just press the H button three times the same way you turn on the headlights with just make sure you press it three times and it'll, it'll turn on and then you press it again and it turns right back off. So, yeah. The lights look amazing. Special shout out to you if you from Ottawa. Never heard of the area, but um seems to be a pretty cool place to go. <laughs> <laughs> 